Loss of weight. He told us yesterday he's weighing about 290. And that's his, proved his get off of getting on the ball. Nice punt by Chris Pavaceres. Jawan Spillman can't get it. The Huskies have it and have it in the end zone. Terry Baltimore scooped it up and ran it in after Jawan Spillman had all kinds of problems. Robert McLean down there to put the hit on. And Connecticut, which is going to need a couple of breaks if they're going to be competitive here today, gets a huge one. On the fumble by Spillman, the strip by McLean. And the touchdown by Baltimore. And Baltimore did a good job of scooping and scoring. Not worrying about just falling, but needing a big play. Connecticut recovered the kick at the eight-yard line. First down. The play is under review. It was a 78-yard punt. Really very little breeze in the stadium here today. It was a windy day. This part of the country affected by the weather that hit a lot of the United States over the last couple of days. Now, I wonder what the review. Is it a muffed punt? Because no, they he mean, picked it up and ran yeah, it and then got, fumbled. This is got, not a muff. This should be a touchdown. Yeah, there's a, he secured the football and was able to turn his shoulders around where he took the hit. Didn't let the ball go. Dennis Hannigan is the referee leading this Big East officiating crew. They spot the ball at the eight yard line. I don't blame Spielman for trying to pick the ball up and run, but this is a great hustle play. to knock the ball out and Baltimore also hustling on his play to scoop and score. McLean was down there playing from his hawk position or gunner position and going down and making a huge play for his team and for Connecticut to be in this ball game. Those are the type of plays, Sean, we were talking off the air that they need to do just to keep Louisville off balance. Louisville not great in the turnover margin. They enter this game just plus two for the year. They were plus three last week in their win at Pittsburgh. So they were minus in the turnover margin heading into last week. Bob Welch in the booth. To review, the call on the field is confirmed. First down. Checking with the booth to see why that was not a touchdown because the ball was clearly secured and the runner was running the football. Fumbled it. UConn picked it up and scored, and the booth will give us an answer. Well, the replay official deemed that that was a muff. Not control of the ball and then a fumble. Then they're watching a different ball game than I'm watching because clearly Juwan Spielman picked the ball up, was able to turn his feet and start taking the ball up the field when McLean made the hit Baltimore came in and scooped and scored 